Ladies and gentlemen, give them a great hand. I, I had a canned speech, but I forgot what to say. All right? All I know is 10 years ago, me and my wife had a vision that we wanted to open up a dance studio that was affordable for everyone. All right? Where everyone could dance. When I first started learning how to dance in the late 80s, it was, it was a pretty exclusive activity. And, uh, you know, it, it, they didn't really have it in my neighborhood. And everywhere I went, they really wanted an arm and a leg. So it was our vision that we would open an affordable dance school where everyone could learn the skill and the art of dance. And that's what we did. I was, I was pretty old. I was 47 when we opened the school. I had been teaching for 12 years already, but I decided maybe I'd better open my own school. I'm getting a little old. If I don't do it now, I'll never do it. And she backed me and she had the nerve and when we opened it, we didn't have no money. And uh, we opened Glendale. Yeah! yeah. Like I always tell everybody, Glendale is the mother of all the dance studios. of the Corona Studio, David. Yeah. Louis, Louis. Yeah. Louis, you here? Yeah. 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 Bam, bam, come out. All the Corona staff, come to the front. Godfather. A couple years ago, I was sick with walking pneumonia. I had it for a whole year. I didn't even know it. Who used to make me tea. They thought he was like my uncle. <laughs> anyway, and I did. I got better. All right. Now I'd like to bring up when we opened our third studio, the Bronx. Bring up the Bronx staff. All the Bronx staff. Come to the front. Everybody knows Poppy? Yeah. Right. He donated his pants for the cause today. Somebody ripped their pants. Somebody ripped their pants and he donated the pants. Alright, everything worked out well. Okay, now I'd like to bring up the owners of the Manhattan Studio. professional dancers, all right? We all made our mistakes up here tonight, but we learned to cover them up well, okay? And uh, they put in a lot of hard work. I know it was a long show, but they didn't, it's not a routine that they didn't want to not do. And I, I told them repeatedly, I says, we don't have to do everything. 
And we didn't do everything, but they, these were the routines that they picked and they wanted to do and they wanted to present to you. And uh, not only are they professionals, but to me and my wife, they've become some of the best young human beings that there are today and we feel that way. So Jackie? Thank you and good night.